The entrance of the vice president signals the beginning of yet another session of the Federal Executive Council meeting. This is a special council meeting of the Federal Executive Council midway into the session. Take some time out to eulogize one of them, the Minister of Environment, Mrs. Amina Mohammed, who is leaving the cabinet for higher heights. I was quite sure that this was the right decision that she, was, that she would make and uh, I'm very, very happy that she did take that, that decision. She's been a great role model, just as it has been said, around the table for so many young people, not just young women. For my two daughters, she's a great role model. They always just say of her that she's the best. While the Minister of Information is glad that Mrs. Mohammed is good for higher heights, those of women affairs, budget and national planning trust she will be a good ambassador. You are the daily minister for all my girls. They look up to you. And they were one of the first to tell you, oh, our idol is living for United Nations. I said, yes, I'm very happy about it. I wish you very much. I miss you already personally. And I'm sure everybody here will miss you. She's very firm and always well thought through. Everybody wanted to say something about the outgoing minister. While some more describe her as a role model to Nigerian women, many others say she is a gift from Nigeria to the outside world. She's become a role model even for my daughter Fatima. Her prodigious intellect, her capacity for hard work, her never say die attitude. I know she's going to do incredibly well where she's going. It's time for her to respond and the outgoing minister could not hold back her emotions. For the acting president, um, I'd like for you to please express my deepest gratitude to President Muhammadu Buhari, our leader. He's not here today but he's in our hearts and our prayers and he gave me the opportunity um, to be of service. She says she is proud to be the one to fly Nigeria's flag up there at the United Nations, promising to give it her best shot. Because as I go to the 38th floor, um, Nigeria's flag will fly high. There's no higher floor in the United Nations building. Madam Amina Mohammed is expected to resume at the United Nations come March 7. The prayer is that Nigeria will be celebrated by the time she finishes with her functions, holding force as the Deputy Secretary General of the United Nations. Chukuma Onwekusi, Channels Television News.